Harry and Meghan flew out of Heathrow on New Year's Eve on BA flight to Nice. The Love Up royal couple then took a helicopter flight to Monaco to see in 2018. But it was a quick visit for Harry and Meghan who are already thought to have returned home to London. Prince Harry and his fiancée Meghan Markle flew out of a billionaire tax haven of Monaco on a helicopter today after celebrating New Year partying like tycoons. A source on the French Riviera told Mail Online that the couple arrived on December 31st and met up with friends. There was speculation that the group may have included Prince Albert and his wife, Princess Charlene, who are the most senior royals in the millionaire's playground in the south of France. Last year, glamorous Princess Charlene joined Prince Harry at Twickenham to watch a rugby match between England and South Africa. By yesterday morning, the romantic getaway had, according to local newspaper Monaco Matin, already come to an end with the pair jetting back to London. They are believed to have spent two days with friends in the principality dubbed a billionaire's playground with one source claiming the couple had celebrated the end of 2017 with Prince Albert and Princess Charlene of Monaco. The source said, Harry and Meghan were somewhere very private and very expensive. Monte Carlo is party central at this time of the year, and the word is that the British royals really enjoyed themselves. The fun could well have been laid on by Prince Albert, who is a close friend of Harry's. What's certain is that they were partying like tycoons on New Year's Day. Fun around Monaco is never understated, and always costs a fortune. But a spokesman at the Princess Palace of Monaco said that the fact that Harry and Meghan had partied with the royals was news to them. A spokesman said, I haven't got any information about that. I'm not aware of it at all, not at all it must have been private if it was the case, but I don't know about it at all. It's news to me. Prince Albert. 59, has already given relationship advice to Harry, 33, and Meghan, 36, following their engagement. The couple's trip to Monaco was, however, kept as private as possible, thanks to a massive security operation. Three bodyguards accompanied them on a British Airways flight from London to the French city of Nice on New Year's Eve when they took up three rows of economy seats. There was no first class on the short flight, but when they got to Nice they boarded helicopters for the seven-minute hop to Monte Carlo. They spent two nights in the Principality, and were then seen boarding helicopters again at 11 a.m. on Tuesday morning. The loved-up royal couple's private flight was a considerable upgrade from their economy trip to Nice, where they are said to have sat beside the toilets among other passengers. In an attempt to remain incognito, the pair boarded their 9.55M flight from Heathrow before any other passengers and headed straight to the back of the plane, next to the rear toilets. They also took up three rows of economy seats either side of the aisle, even though there were only themselves and three edgy and nervous bodyguards in their party. Harry, 33, apparently slumped down next to the window dressed in jeans, a jacket and with a baseball cap pulled over his face. Bride-to-be Miss Markle, 36 was sitting next to him in a black beanie head and minimal makeup. In Monaco it was likely to have been a far grander affair. Dubbed the Mayfair of the Med, 
the principality has become famous as something of a playground for the wealthy. The crystal clear coastline in the sovereign city-state is lined with super yachts, with cars worth well into the millions parked on the streets. The super-rich are drawn to the nation by its relative security and privacy in a space that is only slightly larger than London's Regent's Park. But it was a quick visit for